So, Donkey's done a review on God of War Ragnarok. Let's get straight into it. All right, all right, all right. By the looks of it, Pokemon's going to be mentioned. I know they brought out a new one. I'm surprised he hasn't done a video on it, to be honest. But he did do a, a previous video on the past one, so it might just be later on he's going to release it. But um, I heard that there's a few bugs in the game. As a fond old Pokemon player, I haven't played in years. I sold my Switch. I had to get a PC. Continue doing this sort of stuff. So I have not touched Pokemon in a while, so it might be bad, but as a Pokemon supporter... He's probably going to rip into it, so I'm, I'm, I'm just going to stand it. I'm going to stand it and just just, just hear him out. May, maybe he's got good, good points, but we'll see. And away we go. When I hear AAA video game, I think of stuff oh, like no. this. Like oh, AAA no. video game? Oh, you mean this oh, kind my. of game, right? Yeah, AAA. but that's funny. Mm -hmm. God of War Ragnarok is the rarest type of AAA video game. And that it actually, it actually is a AAA, AAA. Yeah. yeah. Okay. First that's fair. This game race out of a collapsing forest on a dog sled then you fight Spoilers. a giant bear and then you fight thor that is how okay. you do a f video game since the yeah, last true. god of war came out in 2018 there have been a that lot what it looks of like? great action games games like Sekiro, devil may cry mm, Katana mm. Zero, neo 2 hades metroid dread elden ring just two weeks ago i was playing bayonetta 3 god of war has never Damn. been tekken Okay, but Ragnarok subtly builds on a foundation which has aged pretty gracefully in the face of such heavy competition. The key word in describing Ragnarok's combat is balance. It's challenging but okay. not unfair. It's flashy without taking control from the player. It's simplistic but still lets you get a little fancy. Oh, the Tekkas! <laughs> oh my god. It's Mortal Kombat. It's just Scorpion, bro. Jeez. Where'd the floor go? One of my biggest criticisms <laughs> of the last God of War is how it would recycle a lot of its mini bosses. This game okay. does not do that. This game, Woo. you know, Funko Land. Woo. These guys went to fuck no. land. On these bosses. Oh, I went into this game expecting Jeez. the sequel to God of War, Jeez. but really, what we got here is the sequel to God of War and then the sequel to that game. Ragnarok is God Damn. of War two and three in one game. That's how many crazy That's... boss fights are in this. My favorite boss, Damn. I don't want to spoil it, but your goal is to break a big cauldron. If there's one obvious flaw with God of War's okay. gameplay, it's the traversal. It sucks. You look at other Sony games like <laughs> Spider-Man and Ratchet and Clank, mm -hmm. and those games, traversal is just as good, if not better, than the combat. But what makes God of War okay. special is how it marries fun combat with engaging storytelling. Right from its opening mm -hmm. shot, Ragnarok okay. masterfully draws you back into its world with incredible acting performances. There's a much heavier emphasis Boy. this time on building up the world of God of War. There's a lot of side quests and lore to uncover, but for me, the most fulfilling part is just soaking in these beautiful environments there is more artists sounds like a game dev God of War's <laughs> no lie. than there is an entire video games the same uh, tempest of elfheim obscure lantern lit bones of a music sounds sick as well beams of moonlight peer through the leaves of a gungle tree and mufokin heat seems Jeez. to ooze out of the screen and okay. pits of lava lava island from mario 64 there are so huh? many creatures and little details everywhere in this game that sometimes you just have to stop and say it all. Yes, this is the 700th open world game where you lead a rebel force against yeah. a tyrannical dictatorship. You've yeah. seen this story before, but you've never seen it executed on this level before. This is big okay. budget blockbuster entertainment with little interest in rehashing the previous game's story. There is some dialogue that'll make you groan. Everything's okay, right? Yeah, I'm just in a magical forest that shouldn't exist, talking to another giant and she's... Boy. The scope Boy. of this game is much wider than the original, bringing back the original cast while introducing <laughs> many, many new faces like Angra Boba, Tyr, Amir, Mimir, Finmir, Munko, Mumra, and a funny squirrel guy that I like. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes, and I will attend to your needs. Donkeys are very confirmed. Perhaps there was some confusion. This is for calling me out here, not for when I am here. What is happening? 
like hearing the sound of the chime. In the last game, the plot was to take the mom's ashes up a mountain. In this wow. game, mm. the plot, it, I give up. You definitely lose that simplicity and focus from the last game, but there's a new kind of fun in trying to detangle such a massive web of characters. Kratos? Jesus. Snack? I do not need a snack. Ragnarok is Dr. Phil's greatest episode. It's a story about okay. three fathers, three mothers, and three children. Two parents want to shelter their children. Another two <laughs> are depressed because their sons got killed by the other dad. Then there's the fun dad. Oh my He's god. The evil one of them all. After the game, you've lost me already. impregnated by a horse. That's huh? what it says on Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> With so many characters taking the stage, it's a miracle that it doesn't collapse. It's a very segmented a big man. With a lot of video gamey distractions in between. Okay. Destroy four rat nests. But just when I think I'm oh, I hate that stuff. pull me back in. <laughs> While it all hinges on this massive battle, the story unfolds mm -hmm. more like an intimate mystery, giving Ooh, a big incredible snake. cast many scenes to flex their acting muscles. Just like The Matrix, God of War Ragnarok is a technologically advanced thrill ride where rebelling against prophecy only seems to seal your fate. It may not be high art, but it is definitely yeah. high entertainment, showcasing many, many talents at the peak of their powers. This game will surprise you, it'll make you laugh, it might even make you okay. tear up, and it will keep your hands glued to the controller all the way into its action-packed finale. When the credits finally Damn. rolled on this massive conquest, there was only one thing I could say. God What's that? Damn. Oh, wow. Okay. Yo, that was... That was pretty good. That was pretty good. He sold me. Oh, my God. Are you for it? Stop He's gonna go... Stupid <laughs> oh, oh, dear. I'm sorry. I don't know where that Wow. Okay. Clearly he hated the game. He didn't want to play it ever again. And yeah, he thinks Pokemon's better. Damn. I couldn't believe that, Donkey. That's crazy. That's that's a crazy out outlook right there. He's gonna get a lot of hate for that. God damn. Good video though. End of the video. Subscribe. Back to daily uploads.